When people think of scientists, they typically imagine a person wearing a white coat, working in a spotlessly clean lab. That's really not my case. You see, often I go to work at the bus depot in Lausanne. And believe me, a white coat would not stay white for very long there. But what am I doing there? Well, I'm trying to change your behavior. I, more precisely, I'm trying to change the way you think about urban mobility by giving you a proverbial sixth sense, a way of seeing air pollution. You all know that air pollution is bad, that it causes disease uh, and even death, but what may be harder for you to realize is that you can and you should do something about it. Uh, air pollution, one of the ma major causes of air pollution in uh, cities is uh, road traffic, and that's driven by your behavior. Your choice of car to buy or of using a car instead of taking public transportation. I want you to understand that impact uh, in an intuitive and straightforward way. Uh, I want you to be able to see air pollution and the way it changes with your traffic behavior. The reason why I go so often to the bus depot is because I've developed a, a sensor system uh, using inexpensive and small sensors that we've, uh, we've deployed on 10 buses in Lausanne uh, that form a, a dynamic network that gathers data at the street level, way beyond uh, the typical coverage of traditional uh, static monitoring stations. Using data from this network, we are building dynamic uh, high-resolution pollution maps that you'll be able to visualize over the internet, on your computer or smartphone. Uh, and it will help you understand uh, the patterns in air pollution and how the, they are linked to local uh, traffic behaviors. But going even beyond, beyond that, with these maps we will be able to uh, develop a, a wide array of new smart citizen applications like apps that will tell you what's the healthiest commute route or uh, jogging track. Uh, even uh, coupling with uh, your uh, health records, you'll be able to get personalized medical advice. So next time you're in Lausanne, uh, try to spot one of my buses. And why not consider taking it instead of using a car? Thank you very much.